take a seat. <clears throat> and that's it. For another, no, we're back. That's what. Yeah. We're, that is what yeah. is it right now. We are back. And Classic cash freeze, man. We're back doing what though? Churros y puros, man. We're smoking another freaking cigar. What are you smoking, Jeebus? I have no freaking clue yet. I brought a uh, four. Alright, very, very good stogies with me. Alright, go, go for it. Run down the, 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 the top five. <clears throat> top four? <laughs> I said five, dude. Okay. <laughs> go. Uh, Ashton VSG. I think it's the wizard. It's a, yeah, it's, I don't knock you back. Uh, the Viaje. Not sure what size. Let's say, fuck, uh, I don't know. Churchill? Churchill. That's Churchill. Yeah, alright. Pretty good. Got a yeah, uh, Zeno, so let's say things. freaking Panatella. Nah, it's too thick. That's what she said. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, um, stop with that. But yeah, that's, Zeno. You know, that's and, an awesome uh, size. Right? But that might be a little too well, light. It might be a little too light. It might. And well, uh, Padron well. 1964 anniversary series. Did you say Maduro anniversary? anniversary. I was going to say anniversary, yeah. but. Yeah. yeah. Bam, Maduro, my favorite. I might have this one. <laughs> yeah, because I'm smoking an unbanded Padron. I took off the band a while ago. But it's a Padron, you can freaking tell, right? Like, it's the box, box press. Yeah, box press. It's perfect. Uh, and what's up, Jessica Padron? Shout outs to you. What's up? Um, <laughs> hit me up on Twitter, DFLA Music. <laughs> really? Shameless plug? <laughs> Shameless. <laughs> I'm Both sure you... for me and Jessica, man. She's an awesome person to follow. Yes, yeah, yes. Yeah, Not to, you know, on, on Facebook. So we're back with more stuff. I don't even know what we're going to even talk about. No clue. But we'll do what we're, we're good at doing, and that's winging. Oh, you know, okay. Um, every single time I ask you, Jeebus, what the fuck you been up to since the last time? Like, just a little catch me up to the, like, <coughs> to the people out in Twitterville. I mean, uh, YouTube land. Yeah. Twitterville, YouTube land's all the same. Um... Same old, same old school. Uh, just got done with uh, fall. Looking forward to spring. I'm going to have about a month off. I go back February 13th. So, I got a lot of time to, my, <laughs> to myself. Not Nobody sure what cares about do. that. What about that hat? <laughs> oh! You got, I got a new hat. hat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I got a new awesome. hat. I had to retire oh, the other one. The other one's uh, three years old. Yeah. yeah. I still yeah. have it, though. kind of want to throw it away. Dude, it fucking, like, grew mold. I think the CDC <laughs> discovered, like, some top-level mold there. I, I may mess with your cigars. Back to cigars. <laughs> nah, I... I, I Steady gotta, segue. <laughs> Steady. The only kind I know how. Steady. Um, uh, other breaking news. I had a Palio, remember? I'm sure I featured it so many times on this damn show. Yeah. I lost my Palio. Oh. It's See, been missing since... The Vegas Herf of 2011, and I've been searching, and I gave up. I can't find it anywhere. It's probably it, with uh, with that girl that showed her tits at the pool. Probably gave it to her in exchange for... Nah. <laughs> but yeah, I lost my palio. Yeah. <laughs> Feel horrible. Uh, Dude, when you said it, I'm telling you, I heard <clears throat> Psychar from when I treated it like, Oh yeah, alright, you lost your Psychar. You know, and I was no. I, it, ironically, I found that one. Palio. I it's found my. And I was like, "What the fuck?" It's I found my. I found my old Zycar, and about two weeks later was the Vegas Herf, and I lost my. I lost my Palio. God dang it, yo. it sucks. Yeah, it looks like I'm gonna have to save and buy myself another one. So, more good news. Let's keep it. Let's keep it rolling. Where's the cutter at? Uh, here. Uh, what cutter do you have? V cut. But, oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Well, it's not gonna, re- nah, it, it won't work. Dude, Tank says that it freaking works, even on tours. <coughs> so does Jimmy. Alright, let's try it out. A V cut on a torpedo, can it work? <laughs> Bill saying right now, no. Is, is the Pope <laughs> Catholic? Nah. <laughs> Probably not, he's German. <laughs> oh. Ah. That's why you don't fucking do it. No, that, you're fucking, you're, you're smashing oh, it, dude. No, I'm not. That's it, it went through. I told you. Darren, you're wrong again. <laughs> 60 is cold. <laughs> uh, you know what? Yeah, it's still... It's Dude, still back solid. in Nam, we used to just like... 
Right. Right. Because you were in Nam. <laughs> All right. No, Vietnam, freaking um, Idaho. Uh, okay. Oh, look at that. What are you talking about? Just uh, a little bit of uh, yeah. 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 <sighs> Perfect. Do we not have another cutter? <laughs> no. This is the only one I have. Oh, man. That's horrible, dude. <laughs> that, that is, like, horrible. Like I said, if I had my paleo. Yeah, well, if I had a paleo. <laughs> The wood would be a lot brighter. I mean, right. it cut, right? Yeah, it cut. Jacked up the wrapper <laughs> a little bit. You know what, though? It's a, it's a tour. It's a padrone. It's a padrone. Oh, uh, no. That's... No, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, I, didn't, I didn't even want that piece of wrapper, dude. It actually adds nothing to the flavor. That little piece, that exact little piece that looked like Montana, that, that does nothing for the cigar. Little, little known fact, yo. Ah, oh, let's do it. Go for it, man. All right. Today we're recording this on the iPhone. Yes, that's my like, are, are you sure? I have no idea. Today we're Break. recording on the iPhone 4S. <laughs> yeah, recording on the iPhone 4S. Uh, that we're, you know, it's a, it's new technology. This guy's new phone. Why don't you tell him more about that? How much you love this damn phone? Love this phone. I went from like a dinosaur phone to this, and Diamond Lion, Doug, man, he was right. <coughs> this fucking things waste your time. Yeah, they amazingly waste your time. And, um, yeah, it's just fun. It's, I can freaking... Useful, use, right? So useful, man. Check traffic before I get on the road. Series of bitch. I, I could put together all my favorite podcasts. I mean, I have Docs. I have Cigar Snapshot. Big um, ups to Bill on that. It's amazing, man. I keep up with it. It actually... Dude, like, I could listen to it on my way to class, and it's, I finish up the episode um, just, on, just on the way to class. Before, before the way to class. So, um, yeah, iPhone 4S. I mean, but drone's doing something right. We've been saying that since day one. God damn. When you go from a crappy phone to that, it's, it's literally like going from a, from what is it? I stay. Let me try to explain this. Like an Alex Bradley Prensado to a Padron. Wow, really? You didn't think that? You didn't think that highly of Alec Bradley? <laughs> no, I love Alec Bradley. I actually like the Max, which nobody liked. <laughs> <laughs> That's another thing. We were talking about, what was it, uh, Cigar Fist, you know, those top, what was it, 25? Top 10 list or whatever it was? Ah. It's <laughs> <laughs> amazing. All right. Yeah, they're a freaking list. All right. I haven't, I haven't actually seen the list. You haven't seen me, the final list? You've told me some of them. Yeah, so. it has some Rocky Patel stuff. See, the, and, and it just, it's 2011. You have, you have new cigars, you know, like, coming out. Why don't those make it to 2011? You know, you, you can't have repeats. <coughs> even though, this, even though this fucking cigar, I would rate it number one every freaking year, but, you know, like. Yeah, like, that's just me, though. As a reviewer <laughs> and stuff. E.P. Carrillo. You know they gave they they do have like a freaking seven page freaking list of bargain brands, and they're all like seven to they're all like you know, under six bucks or something like that. But um, some of these cheaper cigars, it more inexpensive cigars. Yeah. To fucking battle it out with the ones that were up there. I mean, come on, like, how many times is Gurkha gonna fucking make a list, yo? <coughs> yeah, that's true. Gurkha. That's some stuff's so alright. I'm, I'm not gonna say that. There's Nowadays, I'm sure cigars are a lot better than they used to be. You know, but still, you know, it's, it's you gotta. What about what happened to Kudiwali? That's all I'm saying. That was a really good cigar. I mean, I, I don't have the was it the red labeled one? I'm not sure what it's called, but it's the one with the red label, and that was amazing. And didn't we even agree that it was pr almost borderline sweet? Yeah, man, that, that had a sweet. It was really good. Like that was that was some good tobacco. And I know they have like the brown one, the brown label one. Not sure about that one. I've never had that one. In fact, if anyone has had it, feel free to freaking comment on this video, you know, and tell us how if you what you what were your thoughts on that cigar. All right, we could use some feedback. <laughs> definitely, definitely, and uh, yeah. Well, what else? Chivas, I, I I talked about I talked about this on uh, the Slayer <coughs> Chat forum. Um, what is it? And how often do you go without having a cigar, man? Um, well, we had a cigar. What was it yesterday? Yesterday. Yeah, cigar yesterday. What did I have? Don't remember. But I had. Oh, a, you had the Vegas. 
the Maestro food or something like that. Yeah. It's good cigar. It was actually pretty good. Yeah, we got that one from Doc. From, from Thank you, Doc. And then I had the Illuminati, one of the Illuminati cigars, the Nuevo Mundi. Post a picture soon. But, uh... So, um, anyway, going back to the thing. Uh, what about it? Um, how long do you go without having a cigar? Uh... <clears throat> I guess it has to do a lot with the temperature now that I think about it, because the last cigar that I had had was since yesterday, actually. So do the math. That was like, what, the 9th? Mm-hmm. Or the 10th? The 9th. Uh, my last cigar was in September. What the fuck? So I went, yeah, and that's a long time for me, because I like to post up at night, you know, outside of a porch and just have a cigar, but I guess I just, yeah, I couldn't find the time. Before that, how long, how many times were you having a cigar? Every, <coughs> like every other day. Every, every other, other day, day. Yeah. yeah. Every other day. It's just something about the time. Your door went like, woo! <laughs> now it's going, yeah, it's growing a little yeah, bit. Yeah. <laughs> But we stock it with some puros indios. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I mean, and and but it's good. It's good to get back on the wagon, especially like this. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, man. What about you? I know you, you. You where you're at. It's colder here than here. I was so. I had, I had gone like probably about a month, a month and a half without having a cigar, and then I would then and then for like. Um, Right after finals were done, I had, like, four cigars in a weekend. <laughs> like, I had to work, so I would just have one on the way to work and on the way back. That was awesome, dude. Like, I'm listening to, like, um, you know, some dope hip-hop. By the way, my top three of this year, Rashid Chappelle, Future Before Nostalgia. Get on that, guys. Um, what is it? Epidemic? No particular order. No particular order. Epidemic's... It's a rap group called Epidemic, and their album is called Illine Spree. That one's dope. And Rashad and Confidence, the element of surprise. Top three, 2011. Get those albums if you haven't gotten them. Amazing. So I'm listening to some music or or like a, a, a podcast, and I'm on the way to work, man. I got a freaking I got a cigar. It's, it's awesome. It's awesome. And my commute's like about an hour away, so I could squeeze one in. Freaking awesome. Yeah. So I, you know, you know, I'm having them like, like you want to have a cigar when you can, when you can sit there and enjoy it, you know, like right now, just chilling. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. At, at some point, I mean, I don't know if anybody else feels it sometimes, but some people might say like, oh, you know, or like how you put it, it's like you want to be able to relax, you want to be able to have a cigar, no pressure, you want to just be, in, you just want to enjoy it. Mm-hmm. Time slows down when you're having a cigar. Then I would probably post up the question that, isn't it kind of like, not necessarily lame, but isn't it like more better to have it with people? You know what I mean? Like you're not the only yeah, one smoking. I and I think that's what really slowed me down. Because I, I realized like I'm yeah. having a cigar every other day and I'm enjoying every single cigar. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. But it's like, uh, you know, <laughs> it's like, yeah. all right, fucking uh, quarter to midnight and I'm done. <laughs> Let me go back inside and watch some fucking TV before I pass out. You know what I mean? Like, but if you're at a party... Or, you know, in a gathering, a herf, you know, whatever. It's like you're having it, and you're finishing number three, and the night's still going to go on for about another three hours, you know what I mean? When, like, when you're with people. Like, yeah. a great example of that is, like, at Doc Central Coast Turf, you know? Bill, you know, everyone, freaking Rick, Ricky, uh, freaking uh, Michelle, freaking Christina, you know? Cone of shame. <laughs> the cone of Kilt shame. Bill. You know, we were there. We were having a good damn time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And before you know it, you have eight cigars. And, and, and it's like about a quarter to five in the morning, <laughs> you know? Right. It's, that's my thing. I think that's what slowed me down, and I think that's what... I know it doesn't slow down with a lot of people, but I guess... I, I don't know. I don't know if you feel the same way. Yeah, I do. Uh, for me, um... <clears throat> So, and you know what? The, the freaking cigars taste better, dude, around a bunch of people. I've had some really okay cigars that are amazing <laughs> just because of the company. At the a Rocky Lodge, Patel? At the Lodge hanging out. Oh, no, I've had like a, like a, like a, like a like, and I was like, oh, that's amazing. <laughs> when, I was, uh, when I was helping Doug make, make pasta, watching the water boil, <laughs> that was my job. You know, he, it, like... I, had, I, had, I must have had like a Gurkha and something else, but I thought it was I thought it was good. It was just it's great just hanging out. And again, uh, big ups to Rocky over there at the uh, in, in the Modesto Lodge. Rock on! I, I want to go back to another cigar night, and that's yeah, that's cool guy. <laughs> I met him once. Really cool guy. Yeah. Oh man. Awesome. 
your food. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's not, yeah, not, not start. No, let's not start. <laughs> so, yeah, man, I, I think that's what it comes down to. You gotta have cool people around you, and cigars will taste better. And if you can't, well, at least you got a good companion of a good cigar. Yeah, but even that, you're smoking it away. <laughs> You know? But, I mean, like I said, either way, it doesn't take away from the fact that you're having a good cigar. You're enjoying it, you know? Because it's, it's fucking delicious. <laughs> exactly. Like, I mean, how's that one treating you so far? It's, you could go home for one. I'll, I'll still enjoy it. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> like, this is, this is, this is awesome. This is so awesome. We're going to come back with another segment because we got to check if I got any new text messages. More importantly, that this is still going, so. <laughs> Lock on. <laughs> And uh, we're back from uh, from the porch, and uh, we're smoking a cigar. Oh yeah, there's a dog barking. Look, you see that dog? You see that dog running? Let's see if we can catch it. That dog came over here to get some. I'm trying not to point the camera over there because that's that's where illegal stuff happens. So, Jeebus, <laughs> tell us tell us how this legal product, the Padron, <clears throat> how did that smoke? It smoked wonderfully. I mean, that classic Padron flavor. That light spice because of the my little wrapper. It's it's earthy. It's very it, it, it's very gritty, but almost dirty. It, it tastes great though. It, they always taste great, really. I mean, is there any more freaking words that can't be said about this freaking line, this freaking cigar brand? No, you know? it's amazing. It's amazing. It's, 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 it's we've really already good. done enough like reviews on Padrones to be like they rock. So I think the every, hey, no. Let's talk about something else, right? What else were we talking about? The future of this show. That's what we were talking about, weren't we? Yeah. <coughs> we were talking about the future of this show. And, uh, you know, it was basically when it came down to it, we My thought going to be in it. <laughs> that's going to be that's gonna be us doing a review. From- All right. So, <laughs> uh, we talked about it. We were brainstorming, basically, through a bunch of, like, ideas or whatever. And we all yeah. came down to it. It's like podcast similar like somewhat of a podcast right is that what we're we're, we're heading towards or? yeah something like that <laughs> sorry it's gonna get annoying real quick yeah, yeah it is. <laughs> so um yeah truly see puros i mean we'll still do some videos we'll do videos we're not gonna stray away from the videos and because <clears throat> if there was anything that we agreed on was that we can talk a lot it may not be entirely out of, <laughs> about cigars or whatever but we can keep a good podcast going. I mean, some of it will be like, we were thinking, you know, we could have some bullet points, we could have some, like, notes or whatever, keep on track or what have you, and, you know, but for the most part is that podcasts seem like the way to go. And <laughs> I was trying to make your nose, yo. I'm sorry, yeah, yeah, podcasts, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm I had sorry. to turn around on you for a little while. Uh, I can't. <laughs> I don't know if any of this is coming up, but yeah, podcast. And uh, at least then maybe we could avoid all the all the bo- dogs barking and um, cars passing by. But I think that adds something. Maybe we'll have the podcast out here. No, uh, you don't want studio equipment out here in the public. <laughs> well, I, I don't know. <laughs> kind of in a garage. It's still borderline out in the real world. Yeah, it's cool. It's so, cool. I mean, podcast. That's the future. Like, We'll yeah. still do we'll still do the video stuff. I mean, we're we're trying to figure out in a way where we can uh, produce high quality <coughs> videos that are edited. And uh, and 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 I mean, even like the tele video herf, man. We're gonna video herf it. Yeah, I got a MacBook Pro. <laughs> <laughs> My younger brother's yeah. got a MacBook Pro. Uh, it's not yeah. mine, but yeah. I mean, I am using it. I've been filling it with it, and uh, let's go for it. I mean. You know, the podcast seemed like the way to go because, I mean, it, it's it, they're entertaining, you know, for one thing, and it seems like um, it's a, it's a, an easier way of getting your information out there, of doing stuff, and I mean, like I said, the one thing is we can talk. I think I think we've proven that we can have a freaking podcast. You know, the the thing is, is like um, mics aren't fairly expensive, so we wouldn't have to worry about a mic. So much. I mean, we can just look. We'll get all our tips from from Bill. From Bill. <laughs> hey, by the way, email coming soon. 
And uh, yeah, well, you can do that. And I mean, we'll basically just be doing the exact same thing that we've always done. And I think that's the most important part. We're not necessarily changing absolutely anything, except just a slightly different format. But it's still the same format <laughs> in the sense that we're still going to do some videos, but we're just adding that el element of recording, you know, like yeah. voice wise. Yeah, definitely. So I'm excited. And so am I. And uh, uh, to wrap this up, we'll, uh, we'll be on our game. 2012, the last year of, uh, of this world existing. <laughs> and, uh, and I didn't and, know you were and, Mayan. <laughs> Val's half Mayan. Okay. I can say that. <laughs> <laughs> My girlfriend's half Mayan. No. Um, so you know, more more stuff coming soon. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this uh, the, this this short episode. We we had to do something. Uh, we've been smoking cigars and. We can't we we can't smoke cigars without talking to everybody over there. So, uh, peace everybody on so you chat everybody on YouTube. Um, Churros y puros. Till the next time. Hopefully you'll maybe you'll just hear our voices next time. You don't know. Oh, <laughs> Later, y'all.